we're going to install the trim ring, the trim ring around the box, uh, which will hide this, this irregular drywall cut. It comes in a few pieces. It comes in a top and bottom. They're interchangeable, it doesn't matter. And it comes with two of these extension rings to go from the 14, in this case, the 28. So this kit includes these four parts. They, they only go together one way. You can't really get it wrong. They go, you push them in until they snap. This way obviously won't work, just like so. We'll push them in until you hear it snap. There we go. All right, to install this product, there are holes in the four corners of this enclosure. You'll notice in the corners, there are two holes in each corner. The inner holes, the ones close to the center of the enclosure, are the ones you're going to be using to install this trim ring. The outer holes are for security screws for other applications. So we will go ahead and install the, the top two screws. A little bit in, just turn them in a little bit. The screws are provided with the kit. There's a keyhole on the trim ring which you can drop over the top of those screws. Before you tighten them, start the bottom screws next. You can go ahead and tighten these up. Then we'll tighten up the top ones. Good. There we go. This product includes the hinges already built in, as you can see. So there's no need to use the snap-in hinges. This can be hinged on either side. In this case, we're gonna go ahead and install it hinged on the right. Same as before, snap, snap, snap. In this case, we have it hinged on the right. If it's preferred to have it hinged on the left, simply remove the door, rotate it around, Snap it in on the other side. 